Before we record a phrase, let's first select a kit. Now, let's check the tempo. The tempo is shown in the left bottom corner of the display. You can turn the knob just below the tempo. You can also use the tap tempo function with the foot switch. It is very easy to select a tempo. The tempo indicator can be very helpful for checking the current tempo. Before you start using phrase loop, please press the standby button first. While pressing the button, you can see the beat and measure numbers in the display. Following the overview in the display, you can easily choose the number of beats and measures for your phrase. Also, you can select the click sound to be on or off. As soon as you start playing, Octopath will automatically record your performance. If you plan to always use the same beat, measure and click settings for your recordings, you can set them up in advance. Go into the menu display, select phrase loop setup, press enter and change the settings accordingly. Also, you can choose to hear the click sound only for your first loop recording. Move to the click tab, go down to first loop only and select this in the on position. When you start playing with phrase loop in standby, Octopath automatically starts recording. In the display, you can visually follow the progression along the amount of measures you selected. After reaching the end of the last measure, the phrase returns to the beginning and starts looping. On top of the looping phrase, you can now play the pads and overdub the sounds. You can also use quantize for very accurate recording. Turn this knob to select the quantized note value. After recording, press the play button to switch to play mode. In play mode, your pad performance is not recorded, so you can freely play on top of the looping phrase. Stop the phrase, just press both the rec and play buttons. 